You've heard of Linus' great pumpkin. Well, we saw a man at the Shock Farm Market in Canal Winchester who has more than just one pumpkin in his world. Yeah, this time of year, the Reynoldsburg artist creates a great pumpkin a day at the very least. Kristen Hartman watched him work for this week's Side Roads. Yeah, one thing I learned, art is in Dean Arnold's blood, which runs a little orange around Halloween. He carves pumpkins and gourds, big and small. One takes him five to eight hours. Watch, and you'll see why. Dean Arnold's pumpkin heads are a long way from your daddy's jack-o'-lantern, even if at first he tries to downplay that. Everybody carves jack-o'-lanterns. But not everybody carves like this, Dean. Oh, well, that's true. <laughs> that's true. This graphic artist from Reynoldsburg has an edge and an eye on most of the population. Still, you'd never guess he took up the 3D carvings recently, like last year, after he saw some. I went, wow, those are cool. I wonder if I could do that. He grabbed his clay carving tools and the rest is history. Just about every one of his pumpkin personalities is born in his garage, where Dean gets the really messy stuff out of the way. What's cool is when he puts the door up, you can sometimes watch him work. He says the kids on the bus and their driver get a kick out of it. It's like when she pulls up, she sees yeah. this. Yeah. And then she'll pull up. I'll spin it around. <laughs> and then the kids all go, yeah. And to think, he typically isn't finished at that point. When it's time to fine-tune face details, Dean migrates to the kitchen. It's like a potato peeler. Very much like that, yeah. Where he showed me the craft. Do your hands get tired? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Um, pumpkin Palooza, I blew out my wrist. I was wearing a brace for about three days afterwards. Oh, no. You put Halloween in jeopardy. I... <laughs> <laughs> Luckily, he heals fast and was back at his pumpkin a day. He keeps cranking them out because, as you can see, they have a pretty short shelf life. That's the biggest pumpkin I've ever seen. And if you're wondering who inspires the pumpkin's faces, no one person, really. Dean and his wife say the carvings aren't even male or female. But he has had me make expressions into a camera for reference for him. But you, I have those photos. but you still can't tell. Oh, dear. Speaking of those expressions he borrows from real people, they make him laugh out loud <laughs> while he tries to hit a Halloween home run. Some of the teeth in here. Carving away, tuning out the world around him. My wife, Debbie, calls it Dean time. For the love of the pumpkin, I won't see him for most of the month. Okay, Dean's pumpkins start at $150 and go up in price based on complexity and size. Want to know how to get one? Go to 10tv.com and we'll link you to his Facebook page. Now, Dean based this guy on the expression of someone we know quite well, Tracy. Can you guess who? Let me see. Turn around, pumpkin. Mm -hmm. Is that you, pumpkin? I don't know. I don't know. It, it is, is I don't you. Know. It is me. <laughs> <laughs> it's not supposed That's to awesome. look like you, but catch your expression. Uh, so, and if you look at the eyes, he modeled it after a picture on your Facebook you're page, kidding. Kurt. That's no, I'm honored. and really got the <laughs> eyes and the hairline. That's, that's what kind of gave it away for me. There's the no hair. gray. I couldn't tell. Right. <laughs>